Hey everybody, Dizzy Nails and Beauty here with a special package, something a little bit different um, to my normal things that I normally get, still nail related. I'm not even going to try and pronounce this business because I'm never going to be able to say it. It's, uh, but I will link everything in the description. If I remember, I will write it on the board now of where the company is. But I'm going to get into this and then we can take a look. Right, so just in case you didn't know, this is actually um, an airbrushing kit. These are all the extras I purchased. And here it is, the uh, website. It's www.airstyleart.co.uk. And this lady is absolutely amazing. She uh, helped me through quite a lot. She's even given me, let me share some discount codes, which I'll put in the description down below. Uh, and yeah, so the first thing we get was I got the paints from the pastel colour range. And I'll just so you get like a nice green pastel. That's kind of like a neon colour, that really. Show this pastels yet? Yeah? Definitely says pastels on the thing. Then no, none of a green purple colour orange I think this is the neon range and it's just been put in the wrong um, box maybe because they're quite bright some of those although it could be wrong and each one of these pots I think are 5mm yep they're 5mm it just focused for us so yeah so in each kit you get 2, 4, 6, 8, 10 paints and these are the ones you use for this airbrush and again it's the Airstyle um, brand then we've got the neon colours alright oh, no they definitely was the pastels there because I can see that these are quite bright so we've got nice blue really bright orange bright pink purple luscious yellow there really nice bright green are they the same? no there is this, slight, this, this one's slightly darker another bright pink another bright orange and another like corally pinky orangey bright colour and again you get 10 in that set they did do a um, a glass set as well but I didn't get those and these are the metallic sets so we get a nice silver a pearly white a pearly metallic-y purple a yellow a blue I'm loving that blue a red coppery bronzy colour, a pink, a green and a goldy, coppery goldy colour. Yeah this one says antique gold this one is, didn't realise they all had actually names on them. And that's bronze metallic so yeah. So there is the paints. Then you get this nail art book, this nail stencil storage book and basically they've got these special papers on so that you can once you've used a stencil you could put them on there or you could even just directly store the stencil on here and I think you get 20 pages I think it is um, and they're quite thick the pages here 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 17, 18, 19, 20 and I think they're double sided so you can put them on both sides so that's loads and loads of storage multi-edge stencils easy to attach or remove so that's a great idea 
Then there's a day valued customer card. Then I got the Forever in Love uh, stencil set. It's very hard for you to see really on these, but you get one, two, three, four, five, fifteen stencils on each page. And there, there's lots of like writing and stuff like that on there. Again, it's just the camera's not even going to pick these up. There's like people like kissing there in a the love arse and stuff. So once you take them off, like I can see there's a bird there. Even like me, what looking at it directly, it's not the easiest to see because they're so intricate. But you, you can see you get tons and tons and tons of, of them. And on each back there you've got like the storage sheets yet again to put them on. And this was the one I really fell in love with, the winter stencils. It kind of took me right back to when I did um, paper crafting. Some of the images that she's got on her website is amazing. So again, I'm not going to go through them because you can't really see them anyway. I really can't see the camera picking that up. But... I'm guessing this means it's 120 stencils in each book. And then I've got the geometry, ge geometric space. Again, 120. And it's got all kinds in there. Swirls, not circles, you name it. There's so much. Um, and then I've got lots of other little sheets as well. This one. Two, there's writing on that one. Two, three, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve sheets of other stencils there, so I've got plenty to go at. And then this actual airbrush kit. Oh, we've got the basic um, paints as well, and then this is a, the cleaner for the gun. And I also got the two different types of the brushes to clean the actual airbrush machine out. And this is the compressor, as you can see, it's very, very portable, it's very small and unique. It's got your plug thing there. This is where I'm guessing you're going to put your tube. I'm going to have to read up because I've never done airbrushing before, really. And um, you've got your plug socket there, you've got your cord that's going to go from your compressor to your actual gun and then some like little tool things here, a pipette there, this which I'm guessing is a stand to put your air gun in once it's been in use and then your actual air gun itself, it's a nice weighty air gun and it's got the dual action there, it's got the cup at the top with the lid which is great for people like me who's learning you probably get it spluttering out everywhere so yeah so um just thought i'd share this haul with you i'm not actually going to do it because i need to learn how to do this um did actually get the airbrushed parts and details and the instruction manual which is fantastic and you can see here actually when i said the airbrush that must go into the compressor there so that's really good to have so you can have the there, that on the table, no problem. Standing up with that in, it's, it's really so, so small, it's, it's cool. So I was expecting it to be massive, and the fact it comes in this gorgeous case for storage and keeping it nice and safe is even better as well. And I like the fact that I can keep some of my paints in there as well. So, yeah, so if you want to check out this lady, she has got um, Instagram, she's got YouTube. She's got TikTok. Um, if you, I will put the links to all her social medias that I know of, and then you can check out her wonderful artwork because she's amazing at it. Um, and she even does training. And hopefully, uh, COVID pending and stuff like that, I might even get a chance to do some training with her myself. She was exceedingly helpful. I really wish I could pronounce her name, but I just can't. I've tried, but I just can't do it. Maybe when I meet her, she may be able to like speak to me and tell me what it is, what, how you pronounce it. It'd probably be a bit better then. But yeah, so this is my haul, guys. So I hope you liked it. And hopefully in the future, I can do some airbrushing uh, videos for you once I've got the knack of it, if I do. So yeah, I'll see you soon. Bye.